Welcome back to Extreme Survival. As you see here, I have a lemon. Previously, I did a video showing me starting a fire with a lemon. Did you believe it? Chances are you did. The reason I made that video was to show that you shouldn't believe everything you see or hear on the internet. Now today, I'm gonna to show you why it's not possible to start a fire with a lemon. So as you can see, I have some steel wool here and a lemon with some wires coming out of it. We're gonna to try to get this steel wool to light on fire. And as you can see, we have a reaction there, okay? Look at that. It's nice and warm. I'm gonna put this on the floor on some toilet paper, see if I can get that light on fire, okay? I'll be right back. Now let's take a closer look at this lemon. I didn't spend as much time on this lemon as the first one because it was for demonstration purposes. In fact, this lemon, as well as the first lemon I used in the first video, try not to burn myself here, have batteries in them. They're not actually a lemon, okay? The reason why a lemon does not work is because although it can produce some energy, it does not have enough power to, to heat up steel wool enough to cause a fire. Now in a second, we're gonna get down on the floor and we're gonna hook up a circuit of lemons, 20 lemons in fact, to see if 20 lemons will have enough power to light steel wool and toilet paper on fire. All right guys, so as you can see, we have 20 lemons lined up in a circuit. Now we're gonna see if this many lemons will give us enough power to heat the steel wool and hopefully be able to create a fire or at least heat the steel wool and so we can see some sparks. And folks, as you can see, this is not working either. So, what do we learn from this lesson? Both of the tests failed. A single lemon does not work, 20 lemons do not work. This whole thing is a setup with a battery inside of a lemon. The first video I did, I did a lot more elaborately to try to cover up some of the imperfections in the lemon. So you were, you were too, distracted looking at all the different wires and all the different nails to notice that the, the lemon was actually cut and there was a battery inserted in there which allowed me to start the fire. In real life lemons are not going to do you anything good in the forest or in nature and this is why it's important. This is why I made these videos. It's important to know that when you are in a survival situation that you're relying on practiced true knowledge and not something that you just read off the internet or that you heard from a friend. If you hear something and you want to know that it works Go somewhere where you're not in a real life threatening situation and test it out yourself. Because if you don't know how to do it yourself, you haven't tried it before. And you know, let's just say I was lost out in the forest somewhere and I found a lemon tree and I spent two hours collecting lemons and taking apart parts of my car that was broken down or something or whatever pieces that I had available and tried to do this because I saw it on the internet. I'm not going to have fire. I'd be much better off looking for, you know, a stick and doing a bow drill or something else like that. Anyways, guys, until next time, stay smart, stay alive, and subscribe.